Two weeks from tonight, the Boilermakers will kick off this season with an away game, 2,000 miles away at the University of Nevada in Reno. Greater Lafayette fans want the players and the coaches to know the community is backing them all the way. At the annual Greater Lafayette Commerce football kickoff luncheon, Boilerbackers and team members shared high expectations for the season. They're all up in the future and having a great year and, the, and working with the new younger players. Very impressed with all everybody that came forward to assist everybody else. And they just seem so fired up to uh, to play this season and, and to get better, and they just want to win. The energy that I felt and just the fun and camaraderie and the humor they shared, but yet that competitive spirit makes it a really exciting time to be a Purdue football fan. And I think they're going to give the fans a great show. The players say it helps to have a loud crowd when they're on the field. They appreciate the community support, even though there's pressure from fans who expect a winning season. That's head football coach Jeff Brahms' focus, finding ways to win, like the Boilermakers did last year when they beat Ohio State. We want to do our part as players and coaches to try to put a good product product on the field. I know our fans are excited to get out there with us, our students are, and we've got some great games on the slate, and uh, we're looking forward for game one. Fans credit Brom with cultivating a strong work ethic and positive atmosphere among the players. I think Coach Brom something Purdue's needed for a while. He is so positive and uplifting and puts them first as students, which I appreciate. I think the coaching is outstanding. The staff uh, uh, is all for energy, which transcends to the team. The university and the football program continue to keep alive the legacy of superfan Tyler Trent, who lost his battle with osteosarcoma in January. The offensive and defensive leaders are named the Tyler Trent team captains, and Coach Brom presented Tyler's parents and his brothers with team rings from the 2018 Music City Bowl game. Chris Morrissey-Vitsa, Star City News.